see the ball, be the ball. Often visualization is a big part of the mental game. And one of those big choices can be targeting and how you look at a target. You have to make the choice to physically focus on that target and we're gonna see one of USBC's most technologically advanced products to show you how to target. Visualization is a really important part of bowling. It starts way back in the settee area before you even pick up the bowling ball. The great thing about visualization is it's something you can practice at home. It's all about closing your eyes, visualizing that perfect shot off your hand and watching the motion as it goes down the lane, hitting the pocket. Rod, we have a great tool here at the ITRC for visualization. Yeah, we, we have what we call the goggles, and the goggles is a neat innovation that we have that we actually can see what a bowler's looking at. So even though the bowler is visualizing what they want the ball to do in transition going down, we can actually see what they're looking at when they pick up the ball and the motion that the ball's making down the lane. The interesting thing that we found so far is there's a distinct difference between mid-level bowlers and high-end bowlers. Our mid-level bowlers, their eyes are all over the place. They kind of think they're looking at a target and they'll jump off to the left, jump off the right, look up and down, and they'll swear they're looking at the target. But when we get to the advanced bowlers, elite bowlers, what have we seen? With the elite bowlers, usually what we watch is our break point from down the lane back towards the foul line. That allows us to watch the lane back to front, front to back. Very rarely do we look side to side. And what's interesting is we've seen it on generations, you know, different generations brought somewhere based off target and they say focus on that one target at the end. Others that we're seeing on the new players are constantly moving up and back, but everything's in linear, front and back up in the lane, nothing going horizontal and side to side. One of the great things I found with the goggles is it really showed me on some of the shots where I really thought I hit my target and I was getting my ball to that break point. It showed me, by fact, that I was not hitting my target, so it, it brought out some points that I needed to work on. Yeah, we've actually seen, too, some players have been very in, almost astounded at how much their head moves around. With the goggles on there, we can actually see how much their heads are moving around. Some players even close their eyes at the moment of release. They're trying to get that little extra stuff on the bowling ball, and they actually close their eyes. They don't believe it until they actually see it on these goggles, and it actually, once their mind sees it, just like the visualization, then they'll believe it, then they can do it. So actually what you're telling me is the goggles and you're telling me I'm not perfect. Oh, wow. <laughs> How do you answer that?